Hello, you must be our new employee. I've been expecting you. I'm going to give you a quick tour of the station so you can find your way around in the future, and I'll explain the most important things to you. Here on the wall, you will find our time clock. Promptly at the end of your shift at 8 a.m., you can clock out here and go home. If you like, you can also stay a bit longer and clean your vehicle or do some exercise. Just ensure that you don't do too much overtime as it has a detrimental effect on your health in the long run. You will find drinks dispensers placed throughout the entire station. Make sure that you're always taking on enough fluids so that you're always ready for action. Come on, buddy, stop dawdling. We've got things to do today. This is our fitness room. I recommend you use it regularly to build up your strength and endurance. This is your office. On the wall on the right is an empty shelf which you can use in the future for awards you receive for special achievements. This is our recreation room. The team uses it in their free time to relax a little or to pursue activities together. This relaxation room has been assigned to you. In each 24-hour shift, you have the opportunity to lie down for a total of four hours. If an alarm sounds during this time, you can catch up on any full unused hours of rest later. As I'm sure you can tell, this is our dining room. We always meet up here to have breakfast, lunch, and dinner together. Directly behind the dining room is our kitchen. There's always fresh coffee in there to give your energy levels a temporary boost. Come on, buddy, stop dawdling. We've got things to do today.
We're now at the heart of the fire station. This is our control room. All alerts arrive here and all vehicles are coordinated from here. Come on, stop staring out the window. This is where the action is. This is our meeting and training room. We gather here regularly for debriefings and training. Come on, buddy, stop dawdling. We've got things to do today. Now we're getting to the interesting bits. As you can see, this is our vehicle hall. In the first section, you will find our command post vehicle and both of our fire engines. In the second section, you will find our ambulance and our emergency doctor's car. In the third section are the parking spaces for our auxiliary fire tender, our turntable ladder, and the swap body vehicle. Apart from the emergency doctor's car, you will alternate between duty on all of these vehicles during the course of your service here. Directly behind the third hall is one of our storerooms. You will always find refilled fire extinguishers and breathing apparatus here. Additionally, you will find fresh engine oil here. Always keep an eye on the fill level of all the apparatus on your vehicle, and of course, the oil gauge. This is our washing bay and maintenance hall. High pressure cleaners can be found on both sides of the hall, and on the left is a tire pressure gauge. Always check that the pressure of the tires on both sides of your vehicle is neither too high nor too low. At the back of the washing bay is our workshop. Here you will find all the tools you need for the maintenance of your vehicle or for repairs if something doesn't work. If your vehicle has a flat battery, you'll also find jumper cables here. It's best to start your shift every morning by checking that everything on your vehicle is in full working order. <laughs> 